Hello there. Today we're going to be having a quick and short tutorial about um, creating a pattern of some meshes. So if you haven't watched the previous tutorials about uh, all of the mesh modeling stuff and tools in Unreal Engine 5, there should be a link around here and that. Let's start. Um, so we are going to create a pattern from this one. Let's go ahead and have it around here and then click on pattern so right away you have something that you could work with you can um use the whole pattern to create a line of shapes the mesh that you have selected or a grid or a circle so let's go ahead and use the lines you have x axis y axis and z axis you can change the seed but it doesn't really change anything at, at least in this one okay so by count means that uh, you want to have like something like two you have two three four five oh ten <laughs> something like that you can change the radius if it's set to circle you can uh, change the start angle you can do a lot of things with it actually um grid you can again change the count by x and a y so five by five is a good idea for me at the moment um but most the most important thing you could do with it is in circle because you know it's like the most useful thing um radius should be a lot higher start angle should be zero Okay, I like that. Uh, hit accept. And then you have four meshes created from the mesh that you have selected. If you want to have your mesh inside two, because you know, these are one meshes and this is a separate mesh, you can go ahead and hold control on your keyboard and select both of them and click on mesh merge and hit accept then you can go ahead into the mesh and now you can see that you have a completely merged mesh you didn't even need to model it from scratch you could just you just merged everything together we could go ahead and enable nanite support because why not uh, and maybe something like 10 would be cool and that's pretty much it. Now you have something that's really, really performant, optimized, and useful. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And if you did, please hit that like button. Cheers.